Hello! Thank you for tuning into the Detail Purple channel. Previously, we found and demonstrated that the primary contributing factor of self healing coating is actually the clear coat itself. And it's less about the ceramic coating. So now, that makes us wonder. Will the Optimum Clear Coat Restore Self Heal too? So what is it? At its core, it's a regular automotive clear coat, but it can be hand applied on top of an existing clear coat without a spray gun. Here's a quick recap of what we found in our previous video. Basically, a clear coat has the ability to knit itself back together under a certain temperature. It does not require the assistance of self-healing ceramic coating. What you are seeing here is an OEM, uncoated, unwaxed, and unsealed Honda paint that was just polished and wiped down with GM prep. Then, we poured hot water onto it. And the fine scratches disappeared. For more information, you can watch our previous video, and the link is in the description. Now let's get to it! First, we are going to show you the stock paint thickness before and after application. So right now, it is about 135 micrometers. Alright, first coat. Simply wipe on with enough products so it somewhat self-levels and let it dry. Then, we are going to accelerate the curing process with a heat lamp. Second coat. Third and the final coat. The panel is still a bit hot, but it's all good. It cures faster. Here's the final reading. around 155 micrometers. Just to give you a little perspective on what an increase of 20 micrometers means. To polish out the fine swirl, you will maybe remove 2 to 4 micrometers and 5 to 7 for scratches not fillable by nail. The scratches you are about to see are likely between 5 to 10 micrometers deep. Let me scratch it some more so you can see better. Okay, this time, instead of using a heat gun or hot water, we are going to slowly increase the heat with a heat lamp. Kind of like under the scorching sun. Bear with me while the panel heats up. Watch closely.
for the effect to kick in fully. It's around 85 degrees Celsius, but it starts to work around 65. And all gone. Let's try something cool. Can we leave scratches while the panel is still hot? Or would it just knit itself back together right away? Panel still at a toasty 80 to 90 degrees Celsius. Watch closely. You'll see the scratches heal right before your eyes. Did you see it? Here it is again. It's healing right away. Actually, scratching fairly hard. Okay, I'm gonna. Oops! Scratched right through. That's too deep to heal. For a hand applied product like this, one thing to watch out for is your space and applicator needs to be very clean and lint free, or else you will see all those loose lints. This is an extreme example but it's something to look out for, and the paint's fairly soft. So, that concludes our fun little experiment. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and share with your fellow enthusiasts. See the descriptions below for some more cool stuff that we really like. Thank you.